Coming to you live from the UN Council, this is Optimal Play. I'm Brandon. <laughs> I'm Christian. I'm Katie. And I'm Josh. And uh, we are finally making one of our most requested videos. Uh, lots and lots of maybe you have watched our uh, Sid Meier's Civilization A New Dawn playthrough and a lot of you have commented saying, where's your playthrough with the expansion? It's here! It's now! This is the Terra Incognita expansion. I love it. We are all reasonably seasoned players of this game who yeah. may be brushing up on some of the details. It's been, it's been, we've we've all played more right. than one game, yeah. which I think yeah. counts you as seasoned. Yes. It's just you've yes. played it more than once. <laughs> exactly. And so this won't be a uh, learn to play video. We will certainly be narrating our moves and you'll, you'll see some of the expansion stuff if... Um, you're not familiar with the expansion. That said, it's been out for years, so what are you doing not having played it already? Yes. Yeah. Uh, I'm okay. excited because I've played this game like once, I've played this game a few times with the base and I really liked it, and then I played it with the expansion, I was like, ah, finally, all the stuff that I wish was in the base, here we go. So. It, the expansion is really like, uh, you'll never go back. No, no. never. It's, it it yes. makes, makes some pretty big improvements. I'll caveat that. I think the expansion hmm. makes it a lot more uh, fighty. But I love fighting. If you, if you are somebody who <laughs> love language. Like, actually sometimes prefers to play it less fighty, then I think not including the expansion is a valid option. I But guess. that's not me. But I don't, I'm going to murder you. <laughs> my opinion is that if you want to play a not... In a, a less interactive like Civ or Tableau builder, like there are other games That's for fair. you. That's I, fair. I think that yeah. the, the what's actually happening with your actions and stuff are simple enough that yeah. you want that higher level of interactivity compared That's to. Uh, but let's find out. Maybe we'll all get mad. Maybe we'll all hate it. True, Maybe yeah. this is Maybe so. gonna be awful. Yeah. Uh, so, so, so who are you? Uh, well, I was going to say no. since Josh randomly randomly <laughs> swears he randomly decided that he was going first. <coughs> uh, I was going to say, why doesn't he tell us? Oh, and, yeah. and he can I place his forts. Yeah, I, I considered oh. all our names and randomly selected mine. <laughs> um, I, I, I am representing that. the Zulu Empire. Uh, right, and w tell us. What, I don't actually know what the oh. Zulu Empire does. Um, after I win a combat <laughs> as the attacker, I place one trade token from the supply on my military focus card. Plus one additional trade token if I attack a rival city or city state. So you just want to keep okay. fighting, fight, yeah. fight, fight, fight. So fight, fight. you're like, oh, this game's too fighty. <laughs> anyway, I'm picking the fightiest faction. Hey, you know, <laughs> if we're gonna play the fighty version, I should be the fightiest version. And we're and we're we're doing our we're sort of like we started with our core map out, but yeah. we're gonna be placing forts and then placing our home our home yeah, territory. So go ahead and throw your fort out there. <laughs> so like or it's not really it's not really your fort. I, I don't know so if this is strategically good, especially mm. as the first player, but it Ooh. seems fun. You've so. guaranteed that this kind of like river barrier that uh, formed on the map like has a land bridge. Yes, exactly. right. That's true. And then if somebody would to put uh, a fort on the other side, it'd actually be very hard to cross that land bridge. Right? That's true. Oh, yeah. interesting. That's yeah, an interesting point. Like, I mean, you could go around it. It's maybe. The yeah. Well, if dam, there's, if there's, the right. <laughs> Depends on how the tiles draw. It's called a lake. It does. <laughs> you have to find a oh lake. Oh my gosh. <laughs> uh, how about you, Brenda? What do you got? Katie just invented lakes. Yeah, she just invented <laughs> lakes. Thank you. Uh, I'm playing as the Netherlands uh, leader Wilhelmina. Um, for me, water spaces adjacent to my districts, which are a new type of essentially control token that have specific abilities, uh, they're treated as friendly uh, as, as uh, friendly spaces of all terrain types for my district's ability. So. Some of the districts want to be next to mountains or next to deserts, and water just always counts as what they want it to sure. be, which uh, seems it's fucked up. Good I don't to me. Like it. <laughs> I like it. Um, let me put a fort. I I wanted to have a nice view of that natural wonder, yep. but and not create a lake. I should reiterate since we discussed this a bit before the video: the forts must only touch two hexes. They can go anywhere you want. The fort will not necessarily be Sorry, your fort. Only two? Uh, up to two. Two. Uh, two, 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 okay. two. Two or more. Two or more. I was going to say, both of our moves were not legal. Yes, yes, exactly. <laughs> what you can't do is this. Right. You can't right. put it on a little peninsula. Um, yeah. So I am uh, Suleiman of the Ottoman Empire. I have this Ibrahim card, my, my totally normal and peaceful traitor. Uh, <laughs> I hand this to any other player at the start of my turn. Um, and when they trade with me, we both get extra trade goods. Uh, Sounds great. Sounds great. Also... Uh, when attacking or defending against the player with the Ibrahim card, my combat strength is plus two. Because he's just keeping an eye on things. He's letting me know what's coming. Mm. He's just normal and friendly. Everything's fine. Uh, so I can use him either like economically or defensively, which is kind of fun. Um, and I'm going to place this fort. Uh, and I'm going to place this fort 
Mm. I basically my big concern is that Brandon is going to build some like crazy stupid river functionality where yeah. like he gets like a million lakes next to each other. So I'm just going to try to block off some of those mm. water areas. And a question on the fort placement: Does it need to be near to land or like with this? Any two, no, hexes. two hexes? Any yeah, two hexes. Yeah, that would be an island. Yes. Okay. Yeah. I should also say too, this came up before when we place <laughs> our territory, our um, homelands. Uh, you can use either side. The core oh. ones we rolled randomly. Oh, side, okay. Which, but this one. So oh, before we started, wanna... Josh was complaining that one was, side of his was better I than was, the other. I so. was going to say whining. <laughs> yeah. <but> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And I am playing as China. So when defending, my reinforced controlled tokens increase my combat value by two instead of one. Oh, wow. Okay. That's pretty good. Yeah. And I feel like... You have a wall. No, yes. and so I feel like my yeah. fort placement should be going right on this mountainous yeah. region. Yeah, okay. interesting. Okay. Okay. And now you get to place your home territory, Josh. <laughs> yeah, where is your capital city going? That's some interesting <laughs> sides. Yeah, now, now that I have a choice. And yeah. The rule yeah. for the, these is lose. they must touch four hexes. Four, four hexes. hexes. Right. Yeah. Oh, that's... And they can't touch do. someone else's territory. Oh, they can't? Uh, you can't. So they can't touch someone else's home territory. Sure, yeah. yeah. I'm sure there's a better term than home territory. I'm just <laughs> saying that. But four is <laughs> actually not that... Yeah, that's not actually that hard. You're fine. No, okay. I and isolated then, it and over put there. Your, put your little capital on it. Yeah. I'll go here. I like that spot. Okay. I'm... I want to be friends with that city state that we see on the board, so mm -hmm. I think I'm gonna go. Ugh. Well, that would yeah. just put water between me. And it. <laughs> yeah. So something. Hmm. Put um, it, putting the hex. The hex is <laughs> oh no! This oh, won't no. work at all. Can you flip uh, it? Maybe. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. yeah. That's, okay. That's what you yeah, want. It's, this is where. That's this is where I want to be. be. Oh, okay. I'm isolated. Look at you. You're at the edge <laughs> of the world over here. Hmm. Remember, hmm. I'm fighty. Yeah, yeah, I want to stay the stay hell away, away from you. <laughs> um, what I'm going to do is up here. Which gives me a nice little... I thought you said you couldn't touch mine. Oh, oh shit! Yours is there. Dang. Dang, dude. Cheating Dang, already. why don't you do... I'm cheating already. You know? It's not cheating if I was, someone see, doesn't I, notice. I was surprised by that rule because it seems like that's going to make Katie basically have no... Wait, not yeah. much in the way no, of options. She, she has a bunch of options because yeah. you can also just, like, what I think I'm going to end up doing is this. Whoa! A bunch of stuff over here. Yeah. Aggressive. Yeah. There we go. Nice. I love okay, our map. Katie. Honestly, Aww. this is ridiculous. Seeing how this looks in the top down, I'm like, oh, it's a complex civilization. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> it's, yeah. There you go. All right. Ooh, okay. All right. I am there isolated. Okay. Yeah. There we go. <laughs> did everyone go by the fort that they placed? No, I placed this fort. No, we yeah. did not. Okay, no, we didn't no. do that at all. No. Interesting. Yeah. yeah. Um, let me take this moment for a couple housekeeping notes. Um, hit the like button. Period. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> we'll stop. Uh, subscribing to the channel too uh, is the only way to help us out, help us grow, so we appreciate it. And then um, I, it, it's going to be a game time decision, seeing depending on how long this takes us. But this may be a two part video. If you see part one in the title, uh, look for part two to come to the channel in the coming days. I just try to keep our videos under two hours. Yeah. So, we'll see how badly so this we'll, goes. We'll see how, how long this yeah. takes. We've all yeah. played before, but not in a while. That Who knows what that means for, right, for right. the actual decision making <laughs> on the table. Um, okay, with the initial map set up, I'm about to hit the pause button on our recording, and we're going to set up all the uh, tokens and stuff that go on there, and I then we will get it. going. All that right. Sounds great. Okay, map tiles are populated. Weirdly, uh, we have not struck oil. But we point. have like struck there's, mercury. There's, there's no oil yeah, in the world, but there's lots of mercury. tons of mercury. Yeah, so so uh, funny to me that mercury is one of the like primary resources in this yeah. game. It's <laughs> so important, so significant. Uh, so we have not. Um, this may be out of order for the setup. We have not gone back and checked, but we have not revealed our victory conditions yet. Other than when you play Terra Incognita, there's always mm -hmm. victory conditions for having control of one or two forts. So let's see what else we got. We have industrious or progressive, and I have a reference here to make sure we understand these. Industrious is to have five districts on the map. Oof. Since that goes well with my civ, I'm guessing I'll do that one. Or progressive, control a world wonder from each era. Mm. Remember, there's, there's like medieval, so a one, industrial, two, and, and modern yeah. era. Yeah. Uh, okay. We have provincial, which is have a mature city on each of four different map tiles. Yep. Uh, forts count as their own tile, because you mm. put a city on a fort when you take it over, and you can mature that city, I guess. Yep, yep, yep. Or, or diversified, control three different colors of wonders. Nice. Uh, and then, 
We have Explorer and uh, Aesthetic. This is a base game objective. Explorer is to control 15 spaces adjacent to water Just or like the edge said. of the board. Yep. Uh, there's tons of water throughout our world, so that seems uh, pretty doable. Or Aesthetic, which is to have two culture purple wonders. And um, the win condition is four yeah. halves. You need to have four. You need to have tokens on four of these cards. The forts reflect the current state, meaning you could put a token on it because you have one, but get it taken from you and lose that token. These cards, once you have them completed, you do not lose them. So, right. like, if I get five districts down and mark industrious, and one of you attacks my district and destroys sure. it, I don't. Now, I don't if lose I have that. one and two forts, I would only get one of them. Correct. Uh, correct. Wait, say that again? So, if I had, if, sorry, if I oh, had no. two forts, would I get a token on both of those you would. cards? Yep. Okay. So, so you, if you control two forts, you only need to do two of the three that's of, right. of the okay, other that's objectives. Right. That's yeah. why there's two of them, otherwise... Yep, yep, yep. And Perfect. Josh, as our person sitting nearest the wonders, would you mind telling us about the current uh, wonders? Yes. We ha Do you want me to read the whole thing? Yeah, yeah probably. Yeah. All right. We've got the Colosseum. At the start of your turn, you may reinforce one of your control tokens that is adjacent to a friendly city. Ooh, Ooh that's that's fun. The, the wonders are all super good. Yeah, they like, are. Yeah. The Great Lighthouse. When building cities, you can build in empty spaces on the edge of the map as if they were within two spaces of a friendly city. Ooh. Wow. Okay. Pyramids. When you build this wonder, choose up to three level one cards in your focus row. Replace each with a level two card of the Ooh, same type. Wow. Big science boost there. Yeah. Pretty yeah. neat. Um, and then the uh, Jebel Barkal. When attacking or defending, you can spend resource tokens, not natural wonder tokens, to increase your combat value by two for each resource spent. Hmm. Juicy. Interesting. Okay. Okay, I think the last thing to look at before we uh, hit the ground running, <laughs> hit the ground crawling, um, is we have one city-state on the board, Soul, and the diplomacy card for Soul, should you get it, says, at the start of your turn, you may move one barbarian to an adjacent empty space. Hmm. Uh, I love that one, because it can help keep your cities safe from barbarians, or you can or nudge you them towards your yeah. enemies, which yep, yep, is yep. even more fun. Uh, I think we're ready to go, Josh. You're our first player. You are. What is the Zulu Empire doing? <laughs> I think the first I assume you thing, know immediately. Yeah, obviously, right. yeah. I actually think that the first thing the Zulu Empire is going to do is uh, some astrology yep. to Ooh. advance my tech dial four spaces. Nice. Which lets me upgrade <laughs> one technology, and yeah. I will bring in my Scorched Earth military card. Oh, <laughs> Jesus. Okay. Brandon. Natural. Oh, man. Um, I'm leaning towards exploring. I start with both of my uh, cards with units on them at the top. So let me just use masonry. Move each of my armies up to three spaces. They can move into spaces matching this slot's terrain or lower. So they can move into mountains. So my army, this is new in the expansion, you have armies. Mm -hmm. uh, instead of abstract, just, just attack concepts, where, yeah, wherever yeah. you want to. I'm going to move it one, two, and explore this way. Yeah. And I want to attack that city-state. No, I don't think I'm going straight into <laughs> Warfare with Soul. Uh, so let me... Uh, could you hand me the bottom tile of the... Thank you. That's what Ooh, you got. It's going to have a city-state. Juicy. And a barbarian and a resource. Um, it's a little... This water side is a little too much water <laughs> for my taste. So I think I'm mm -hmm. going to go do something over here. It fits nice. Oh wait, uh, no, it, it doesn't, doesn't quite fit nicely it there. It fits here. Yeah, that fits. Yeah. Um, no, it has to be touching four hexes, right? It does. So that's well, one, yeah, two, one, three, two, four. three, four. Oh, oh because of over there. Yeah. yeah. So, okay. Let's let's do this. And I believe you infill <laughs> with water when you do this. Uh, yes. Yeah. Yeah. You, we the holes in the oh, table yeah. become water. So much water on our map. We have a very map. Yeah. what a wet map. Wet. Yeah. Okay, um, I will. It. Uh, that's going to be the end of my move yeah. since I used my third movement point to do that. So I can populate those tiles. Oh, and while you found Christian some barbarians. Yep. Yeah. Uh, okay. First of all, I'm using my Ottoman ability as the Ottoman Empire. I'm giving the Ibrahim card to you. Ooh, thanks. You. So uh, when you trade with me, we each get an extra trade good, uh, and also uh, I can defend against you <laughs> uh, if you attack me. Or if I attack you, it's great. Uh, and then I'm going to use my foreign trade ability. Um, so I'm going to go move my caravans three spaces. So I'm going to do one, two, three. You only get wow. resources when you spread control there, correct? Sorry, say that one more time? You only gain resources on the map when you spread your control tokens there. Yes. When you trade through them. Yes. Great. 
Uh, as an update, the city-state I added to the board is Kabul, and its um, diplomacy card says, when attacking a city or a city-state other than Kabul, increase your combat value by three. Oh. Yeah. That's strong stuff. I love it. Okay. All right. I'm going to actually use my early empire mm -hmm. and place two control tokens yep. out. Boop. Boop. Love it. And that is it. And now our, our timer advances... Uh, so the barbarians are about to move. Uh, Josh, would you do us the honor of rolling the barbarians? Oh god, don't don't uh, just one of these. Right? Yeah, yeah, don't roll a six. six. That'll take out my army. <laughs> six would be great. Oh, it'll attack. It might not necessarily destroy you. Here right? comes six. Oh, does it? Six. Oh, god. <laughs> All right. So this one moves here. This he one's bounces. gonna bounce off the edge. And then this one does it attack my army? Do we I, roll? No, I, I think it actually just destroys. I, I think when it right. moves into something, it just yeah. destroys it. So no. kind of brutal. <laughs> I love it. That's fine. I, you're, you're up. It Back to the top. All right, right. All right. Um, okay, so I am going to use my Scorched Earth, and I'm going to move each of my armies up to four spaces. The first one will go one, two, three, four, and attack this Barbarian. Mm -hmm. So the Barbarian's defense is forest, which is three. And my strength is five. Yep. Um, oh, uh, I, I just glanced at the rule book. The one thing is the Barbarian, when it takes out an army, does not occupy its face. It bounces it's off of it. Yeah. And uh, can you confirm, <laughs> attacking a Barbarian, its defense value is... the, the it, We add to it's, the roll it's, just it's, its terrain. It's terrain, yeah. That's it. So I'll roll for the Barbarian. Okay. So its terrain is three. Seven. Four and four. So uh, nine. You got him. All right, nice. So, so you can... Uh, gets removed from the board gain, for now. Gain a trade good. Mm -hmm. Uh, and I actually get two, because after I win a combat <coughs> as an attacker, I place one trade token yep. onto my military card. The other one, I think... You know, I might think on that for a second, because uh, I'm just going to move my other army in the meantime. Jeez. Yep. This is, uh, I'm going to go for the Double armies so already, one. Jesus Christ. Uh, actually, no. I'll go one, two, explore off this direction. Okay. So I... Uh, Change from my initial instinct of exploring off the mountain to exploring off here, and I deeply mm. regret it. <laughs> I would love to be able to use this straight edge in a, in a way, but you know, uh, we're gonna Time go to here and shift, shift the map, the map slightly. Map. Yeah. Yeah. slightly. There we go. Earthway. That's it. That's it. We're done. <laughs> Tectonic movement. Great. All, All right. right. Uh, we need. And then you move into the map when you do I that. I do. Right? Yes. That um, looks like the Grand Mesa. So that was one, two to explore, uh, and then. Three to attack this barbarian. Oh right, which spawned. That yeah. is barbarian D. Also, there should be some mercury on that tile. Um, here it is. And his defense value is only one. What one good option. luck. Five, six. I did okay. fine. Um, so I'm getting another on military. And yeah. I'm going to put some. Wow, well done. Um, and then that's. Oh, I can move him one more. Um, <clears throat> could keep exploring. No, I can't. Well, I could. Well, not this turn. Oh, no. Yeah. After it fights, that ends its movement. Oh, it does? Yeah. Okay. Perfect. Yeah. Good. All right. And then I'm going to figure out where these go. I think they're just going to go on pottery. Great. And okay. your, your uh, scorched earth bounces down, right? Because that was the Ah, uh, yes. Took. Yes. To me, huh? Um, I think I'm going to get expanded. Yeah. Uh, oh, shoot. I forgot forts or cities. I was I was about to put a city here so that it was I could that put control drain. points on yeah. that mercury, but yeah. the fort is a problem with that plan. Oh no, yeah, I don't have anywhere good to expand to yet. Hmm. Well, then I need to adjust that plan pretty quick here. Why don't I? When are we about to do? Di We're about to do districts. We are. Yeah. And my oh, districts yeah. are super powered. Um, if I were to put down my district that wants to be next to mountains, then this space would be mountain, mountain, and water counts as mountain. So that seems good. I'm just going to go ahead and do ir irrigation. It's in one of my one slots. Place a district on a space matching this slot's terrain or lower that is adjacent to a friendly city. So I'm going to put my campus, my science district, right here. And that, when the districts uh, trigger from the event dial, I will place one trade token on my science card for each friendly mountain or natural wonder that is in or adjacent to this district. And so that'll trigger three times for me. Wow. Juicy. Uh, irrigation will just slide oh. down back to the lowest spot. That's it. Okay. My military, I'm taking my masonry action uh, so I get to put my army out. Um, and then I'm going to move it 
here to fight this barbarian. That's that's gonna be it. So someone roll for the barbarian. Yeah, it's defensive it's in value the hills, is two. So two. Okay, here we go. Uh, they rolled three. So you got five total, but I got mm. six total because I was Ooh, over just, off the six. Just got it. Okay, yeah, got it. Oh, which gives me one trade good, right? Yep. Any on any on uh, any slot card you'd like. Choice. Great. I will decide that in a moment. Katie, go ahead. All right, I'm gonna use my writing at my level five pottery. and move my tech dial up as such mm -hmm. uh, and upgrade my science. I love it. Oh, you got you got the boosted science already? I got the boosted Damn. science. And so we tick tock up to districts. Yeah. So uh, the and event the event for this round is just districts, which will be my campus is going to generate three trade goods oh, on my science card. Spicy. <laughs> very good. Back to Josh. All right. Uh, I'm going to use my foreign trade card and just uh, move my caravan along. It doesn't really get to do oh, much. So much science. But um, I guess I could explore with it. So that's what I'll do. I'll take another explore action. Okay. Um, Ooh. That That's so fit. many mountains. Yeah, it doesn't quite fit, unfortunately. But maybe like this. Yeah, that fits. That fits. And that's legal. That seems like a lot of mountains. That's probably good for something. It's cool. got to be good for something. Yeah, that's the. Uh, is that crater Do I lake? really want to yeah, have to yes. move through all that, though? <laughs> <laughs> that is the question. Yeah, what the hell. Let's do it like this, though, so that diamond's a little closer to me. Makes sense. There is the is Crater Lake, and here is a Jeez. diamond. Love it. Just some extra some extra mercury over here, and a mercury natural wonder over here. Right. Just in case I didn't feel like there was enough mercury around me. Mm -hmm. I basically am swimming in mercury. <laughs> that doesn't sound safe. It doesn't. It's dangerous. <laughs> <laughs> it's, well, my people don't know any better. We're still in the ancient era. Right. Yep. yep. Okay, uh, time for some foreign trade myself. I do think I want um, Souls Diplomacy card. So, I'll use foreign trade, move each of my caravans up to three spaces. Mm -hmm. They can move into the slot strain or lower. It's, it's in my mountain slot, so <clears throat> I think I'll go one. My tentative plan is use a point yeah. of movement to explore yeah. here and then yeah. just move into there. So, uh, hand me a tile to explore, please. Uh, yep. Thank you. We got this one with barbarians that would pretty much have to go right next to my city. I uh, don't love that. You have hmm. very few options, actually. Yeah, this is not great. I guess this one puts the barbarians yeah, on the other got, side of the water from me. Yep, yep, yep. Yeah, not the most, if not the the most exciting tile to have just placed, but can the barbar we'll that. can the barbarians conquer the city state? Uh, they... They destroy city-states, I, I believe. No, 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 I think they just enter city-states and sit there. I oh, think they can... Co I, we, yeah, if we'll that comes up, we will have yeah, to check yeah, it, I think. Right. Uh, so that was one point of movement, a uh, second point of movement for the exploration, and then the third one will send it into Seoul. Yep. So I am going to get two trade goods on my... Oh, no! Science. Science card, which is wasted. I maxed. Uh, so that's a, a little bit of a bummer, but I wanted the Soul Diplomacy card, and I got it. So, so there you go. Um, and what's a Soul Diplomacy card give at you? At the start of my turn, I may move a Barbarian to an adjacent empty space. Hmm, that's fun. Yeah. Barbarians are my pals. I love it. Um, okay, my turn. Um, man, oh man. You can block Barbarian spaces with a city, correct? Like they don't spawn there anymore. Um, yes, any any kind of token blocks barbarians from okay. spawning. Um, just thinking, that's, and that's they're not going to spawn for. A that's while. actually the pretty. <laughs> I, I find that a really clever, elegant way for the barbarians to die out yeah, as like, like time goes on in this yeah. game. Yeah. Is that you just cover them so they stop. There's spawning. There's so many cities that are afraid to die. Right, right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and um, I'm sorry. When I if I were to use my foreign trade to go to Seoul, it would return to my card. Would I still have extra move because it gets three moves? No, you can't like depart your city yeah, again. Okay. Yeah. yeah, that's what I thought. Um, but it might be worthwhile. Ugh, crap. Um, or alternatively, sorry, give me one moment. I just want to make sure I know what my industry does. Sure. Hmm. Okay. I've got I've got plans. Mm -hmm. I know what I'm mm -hmm. doing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Sort of. Mm -hmm. Man, I need so many more resources than I have. <laughs> How do I get more resources, dude? Uh, the answer is trade. Um, you know what? This is what I'm good at. Um, so I think, I think the answer is 
my economy card is, yeah. Yeah, that's the answer. Okay, <laughs> I'm gonna do astrology, my science. Uh, it's in slot three, so I get one, two, three, which gives me my first upgrade. Uh, I'm gonna upgrade my f economy card. So I now have my, cur I have currency instead. Ooh. Uh, which gives me an extra caravan. So my 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 caravan comes out. Mm -hmm. Slide all that down, um, and then uh, my caravans can now fight barbarians. I guess. Uh, <laughs> I think you pay them off. No, I fight them. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> uh, that's it for me. All right. So I'm gonna do some foreign trade. So I can move each one of my caravans up to three spaces, uh, and so this one moves at the five spot. So I'm gonna go ahead and caravan over to this little diamond mine Ooh. over here, because that feels correct. You can't do anything with the diamonds unless you control token them, right? Right, correct. So is that what you want to send? You gotta send them to right, city. Right, but don't I need somebody over there to then place that far out? It's with what, so tokens, or no, no? tokens are based no. on your card, which yeah. is right now. Oh. Yes, yeah, so that may cities. not help you much. So maybe you moving just... it over to the city then. That's not even a city. Well, that's just exploring oh. is probably the best thing to do. Yeah, yeah, you could try to you could explore with it. You could try to head to this to Kabul. Oh, um, that's the one but that gives you. You can't. Oh, you got water. Yeah. Oh wow. Yeah, it would be a completely blockaded. You, I, you might want to explore this way, because can that might, you can no. find a road. Can caravans oh, not go okay. through forts? Uh, on on occupied so. forts? I would have thought they could just move through them. Um, I will check, check that. But this yeah. is probably the fast route anyway, unless you just draw a terrible tile. Which you could have. It just happened to you. It did. Weird. Hmm. Let's see. Caravans and armies can move into forts. There you go. But if an army moves into a fort mm, that's not controlled by a player, it... Performance attacks. Yeah, oh, I didn't can actually finish his movement. They, they, they are two to explore, and they should have moved into here. Yep. Cool. Not that it really matters. All right. Um, Josh has yeah, just got units everywhere. On that side then. So one, okay. one to Another. explore. <clears throat> and you can choose which side to use. Oh, Ooh. That's yes. Good. Oh, okay. a natural <laughs> wonder. Um, probably the other way? That way? Uh, like this way, maybe? Oh, but I see. Yeah. If I go this oh, way, Oh, we can this move way, this. Yeah, yeah, you can yeah. move that. Yeah. So it could be like this. Oh, that's that totally fits. That's yeah. really good. Yeah. I like that. Nice. Love it. Yeah. And then can you populate with all the various? Um, yes, we've got. Uh, you do have a barbarian. Yeah. I do have a barbarian, but we Those can. Those are two turns, and you still have you still have one more, more move. That this one. was the movement point, wasn't it? That's oh, that. you're right. Exploring yeah. is one of them. Entering yeah. is one. Mato Tipila. Ooh. A Did world she have to enter the new with. town? Uh, yeah. Do you have to enter the new town when you explore it? No, because you could use your last point of movement to so explore she could retreat and, yeah, away so from the. Totally. Yeah. Yeah. So do you, I mean, it's whether or not you want to be close to the Barbarian, who's not... It's a one in six chance, yeah. but uh, there's also two, well, it's about to activate, and you'll have another... Actually, if you move it here, you could literally, because you'll be in Grassland, so on your next turn, you could go here if you wanted to. Oh, okay. Yeah. 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 I'll chance it with the Barbarian. I love it. Feels right. Sweet. Okay, so we go up to our governments. Yes. Yes, okay, so uh, we can all install a type of government. We have... Uh, oligarchy, which lets us treat our economy card as if it were two spaces higher than it was when we revolve it or resolve it. Uh, Republic does the same for culture. Monarchy. Monarchy does it for growth. Autocracy does it for military, and then democracy for science and communism for industry just do one space respectively. Fascinating. Yeah, it's a tough call. Um, mm -hmm. I'm pretty torn myself. I think I'm gonna take industry. Uh, okay. Um, industry cool. being, which uh, that's communism. Here you go. That sounds right. <laughs> the Zulu are famously mm -hmm. communist, right? Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, yeah, I think so. I'm gonna take science. <clears throat> I'm hmm. like democracy, I should say. Hmm, hmm, hmm. I think I will go culture. It's about to be your turn, Josh. I'm gonna go growth. You got it. Okay, so I'm a republic and you are a monarchy. A monarchy. Wow, we all we went for four yeah. four different four government types. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Josh, what are you doing? Um, Wait, on. one more thing on that event dial. Uh, that wonder symbol. Throw a trade t uh, th trade token on each wonder. 
they, get they are all one cheaper now. Oh. And then the oh, next okay. time we hit that wonder symbol, which is in three more rounds, uh, any that still have a trade token on them will just be discarded from the pile. Yeah. In that case. Mm hmm. Hmm. Oh, we should have thrown some yeah. marble um, in this new tile. I'll just run pottery with my new government. Huh? So five with two trade tokens is seven. And I will build... Oh, that stays. Um, the Great Lighthouse. Love it. Wow. What's that doing one more time? Um, when building cities, I can build in empty spaces on the edge of the map. Oh, as yeah. if they were within two spaces of a friendly Ooh, city. Pretty good. Wow. And you must put it in a city, so can you get him the Great Lighthouse from the uh, yellow stack? Sure. It looks something like a, like a lighthouse, huh? But like a great one. Yeah, a really, uh, really great one. Yeah, is that it? I think that's yeah, it. I guess that's great enough. <laughs> cool. So. Brandon. Brandon. Oh wait, we have a new we have a new uh, <laughs> wonder, which <laughs> is Apadana. Oh, yeah. uh, when you build or capture this wonder. Choose an edge space on the tile, on any tile, explore from that space, and then if you place the tile, uh, place one control token on an empty space on that tile. So you get to just mm. keep exploring off the edge of the map, which is wild. I really want all sorts of weird control bullshit. I really want the pyramids, but I don't know if I can get them before they rotate out. So uh, okay, well, um, Soul, at the start of my turn, I can move a barbarian to an adjacent empty space. I'm going to send the barbarians that Ooh. way. Mm -hmm. And I am going to gamble that they are going to leave me alone and not attack the city I'm about to place with pottery. Uh, placing a city on a legal space of this slot's terrain or lower, which is mountains, within two spaces of mountains. Right I'm going right move. here. Oh so my once, god. Once That's they're dead, spicy. they're not respawning. Uh, yeah. But I am not oh my god. defeating juicy, them here. Juicy. Yeah. All right, that's my turn. Okay. Um, I am going to do currency. So that means I get to move, I now have two caravans. Um, I'm going to move, and they got, it was in two. So this guy can move through hills and lower. So I'm gonna explore with this guy first. So one, and then explore in this direction. Ooh, okay. Give me a tile. Uh, yep. We've been exploring fast. That tile, is, tile pile is starting to get slim. Ooh, we found a city state. Yeah, that's what I want. That is the culture city state of Mohenjo Daro. Love it. Thank you. 100% um, sure I'm saying that, right? And then an oil on it as well. So he, it got four moves. So I actually can I can make it. So that was one, two, three, four. I can immediately wow. get there, which I shall. Okay. So you get two, two. trade tokens on your culture card. Yep. And you get their uh, diplomacy card, which I hadn't even read to you When yet. you are placing control tokens, the difficulty of all terrain is reduced by one. Seems good. Uh, and on the culture card, which is, yeah, sure. I love that mm. every ability that you get from a wonder or the diplomacy card, like, it all just feels so strong. Yeah. It's, it's, all, it's, it's all, all very huge impactful. Huge. Yep, yeah. Yep. Um, and then this one is going to go to soul. So I get the soul ability wow. as well, and I get two okay. onto you're, my... You're in control of barbarians also. Two more uh, trade to mm -hmm. go onto my science card. That's it. Katie, you're up. Sheesh. Right. Oof. <clears throat> so I feel like at this point I should build a city on the diamond. Um. On the di... Uh, you... Yeah, it's, in, it's yeah. legal. If right. you have, yeah, yeah, you absolutely yeah, should I... be doing yeah. that. <laughs> Makes Can sense. You, uh, it's from it's from friendly it's territory. It's from within two spaces. And yeah, but I can you? Control, control should I double it. check that? Mm. Yeah. Is, does it have to be an empty space? It says a legal space, but it doesn't really On define that. A legal that. space if this slot's train or lower within two spaces of a friendly space. Because I remember that was on our last video of this. That was the number one correction we got in the comments: is you were putting cities places you shouldn't have. Ooh. Um, Interesting. Yeah. So let me That's double okay. check that building cities. <laughs> yeah, okay, this is what I thought. A player cannot build a, a city on a space that contains any component other than a caravan or friendly control token. Oh, wild. Token. So to get those resources, you need to build cities next to them and then get control tokens. Ah. Yeah. Which you can still do. Which, yeah, I can still do. Uh -huh. Although I don't think you can build here because it's not a fort. Yeah. So here there. I think so would be have okay. To go there. Yep. That seems a little... I mean, you also don't have to build your city there, right? Like, you, you could... Because eventually you'll be able to get control tokens further away. That's but fair. it's up to you. 
But I already have it on five. And well, control I, tokens only can be adjacent to a city, at least with the default. Mm. I think once you expand, once you upgrade yeah. the culture, yeah. you'll, you'll find more ways I, to get them I further out. I think that this is still the right one. <laughs> I, I love it. I okay. Love it. Okay. Right okay. All right. A barbarian, the, the barbarian moves. Don't oh, pose me. Five. five. Okay, phew. There's two barbarians. All right. Oh, yeah. Oh, there is oh, one. Yeah. Okay. Katie, yeah. Katie dodged the bullet because she didn't move before hand. Yep. Oh, Josh, that was up. close. Right. I would have liked yeah, it to move just entirely away from my uh, city, but <laughs> what, um, what can you do? Are we... Okay. Um, so... <clears throat> I don't actually know what I want to do at this point. Um, I guess I'm going to go ahead and do early empire since it's at the mountain. Yeah. On place, it's just sad to place only two control tokens with it, but this Mercury is probably gonna help me. Um, oh, Mercury seems good. Oh, I guess I'll do here. I don't want to do the other mountain. Okay. Yeah. I'm gonna also do early empire. I'm gonna treat it as if it's in slot five because I'm a republic, and throw two control tokens onto. Uh, the Mercury here and the Mountain here. So I'll claim that Mercury. Christian. Mm. Oh shit! I'm gonna take that. I'm, I'm gonna undo all that. Yeah, go for it. <laughs> yeah, man. since you weren't ready. Anyway, I just looked at the event dial and I need to use my um, science trade tokens <laughs> because I, the the uh, district's firing is just going to restock them. So let me go ahead. The, the, reason, the reason I was reluctant, or I had thought about that already, the reason I didn't want to is because it sucks when your government is already in the top slot. Like, why, yeah. why do that? But I'm just playing badly, apparently. Yeah. So I'll use astrology to advance my science dial uh, equal to its slot, and then I had three trade tokens wow. that I'll go ahead and eight. spend. So eight. Jesus. Uh, do districts count as control tokens? Like, do they... they <clears throat> I guess they count as friendly, uh, yes. and they count they, for Yes, they are, they are control tokens. Okay, yep. So I'm going to use my growth card... Uh, to put a district uh, into here, because that district is about to fuck. Really it's about like to what? It. It's about to proc. It's about oh, to proc. I said it's about to fuck. <laughs> that too. This district fucks. <laughs> um, that's me, Katie. Um, I think I will upgrade my foreign yeah. trade to currency. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna put out my army. And, and it's gonna go here. Well, like, can I put it here? So we're ticking the district. So I get yes. a trade token onto industry for every adjacent forest. So my, you get one. My my uh, campus gets another three. Thank you, Netherlands ability on astrology. There we go. And Josh is up. Um, and I am going I had not to even finished my build upgrades. as though I'm in the right. second slot, and I'm going to build a city right here. Which I actually don't even need Lighthouse for. That's a, That seems like a waste. Yeah, that's <laughs> true. <laughs> sure you don't want to just put it, like, here? Yeah, I'm still <laughs> sure. Okay. Uh, all right, I will... So use I'll use the soul power to push this barbarian another space from my city in. Jesus. <laughs> Eventually I'll find. You could a, push it towards the caravan, like if you want to be rude, push it towards orange. Uh, but here, I had I pushed it here. No, you had pushed it. It was here. And you it were marched. Gambling. Oh, that's right. And it marched. Well, it marched up here. It marched there. Mm. And so then you pushed. It. Oh, yeah, I see. Probably I see. Right. I see. He doesn't yes, want to. Yes, yes. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Right. Right. Okay, so I will use Early Empire, placing two control tokens that match friendly cities. Is that right? Do I, would I rather get some control tokens on this with caravans? No, it's fine. I just hate using, uh, my, I think I, I chose the wrong government. And that's basically what this means. <laughs> yeah. The Republic was not actually for me. Uh, yeah. But I'm going to put control tokens uh, here and get this Mercury. And then I will throw one... Mmm, it's interesting. I could. Let's see. No, I think I'm, I'm, I'm gonna want my irrigation to place another district, not to reinforce control tokens. So I don't want this where the barbarian will just eat it. I'll put it here. Great. 
Uh, I'm gonna pop my industry card with two trade goods, uh, hitting me up to a value of six, letting me build a Jabal Barkal. That's all it costs? Wow. Yeah, the minus one. Yeah. So I get Jabal Barkal, uh, give me that icon when you can, give me that token. Yeah, what's that look like? It looks like a little, a little fortress. Um, which is, uh, when attacking or defending, I can spend resource tokens to increase my combat value by two for each resource mm, spent. Right. Not super valuable, but you know what is valuable? Having a fucking wonder. We have multiple things <laughs> that care about wonders, so that's and, Well, and when, when you, I assume that the window that you can do that is, that the, is the same as trade goods on your military card, which is after the rolls, exactly. which makes that pretty powerful. Yeah, yeah. And then our new wonder is Petra. When defending, increase your combat value by two. Barbarians cannot move into spaces containing your cities or reinforced control tokens. Pretty Ooh, sick. I would have preferred okay. that one, but you know, what are you going to do? Oh, that takes <laughs> oil and diamonds, though. All, right, All I have I'm going to use mercury. my early empire <laughs> and place two more control tokens. For a desert um, or lower? Yes. But I'm deciding because I could have a mature city here immediately. Mm, yeah. Or I could go this out. way. And do a mature. Mm, actually, I think this one's already gone. Okay. All right. What does a mature city get you again? Um, it's there are certain components <laughs> that like require. There's, there's, that uh, require a mature city in order yes. to acquire the benefit. Uh, you can, uh, your caravans and I think your armies can depart from mature cities or your capital. So it gives you more yes. places that those can spawn Correct. from. And also, it is our objective to have mature city, or one of our objectives to have mature cities on four tiles. Mm. Yep. So those it's are the main two. In the base game, that also determined your like uh, trade good income when yeah. that event mm -hmm. uh, fired, but that got replaced with the district system. So that's guess what? Barbarians are back, and also cycle the. Um... Oh no, my pyramids! Oh no! All right. A. So trade H. goods on the two that were already out uh, that did not have one, and cycle. D out is the gone, others. I think, right? Because you blocked it. Yeah. Right. So now we see the Great Library. When your caravan moves to another player's city, you may gain a focus card of the same type and tech level as a card in that player's focus row, replacing your card of the same type. Hmm. And um, the Hanging Gardens. At the start of your turn, you may place one control token on a space of terrain difficulty four or less that is adjacent to a friendly city. Hmm. So both seem great. Yeah. Yeah. All of them are good. Josh, you're up. All right. What was I planning to do? <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> I'm trying to figure that out myself. Yes. All right. I will... Well, maybe maybe I should kill those barbarians. Since they are there. <clears throat> Since they are there. Uh, I, don't, I don't love the part of the world I have found myself <laughs> in. I don't love... Yeah, it doesn't, it, it doesn't have a lot of room for expansion with a fort here and a city-state here. So the barbarians are currently on a one terrain... So attacking them with a three is probably fine. Probably right. fine. So yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna attack the barbarians. Okay. <laughs> Christian rolled a one for it, and you roll and a two. two. That's plenty. Okay. Yeah, Take a trade good of your choice. Two trade yep. goods. Um, one of them goes on my military card. Uh, yep. Yeah, I guess that's fine. And then the other one is going to go on to. Hmm. hmm. Pottery. Uh, and then my other unit can move up to four spaces, um, but only forest or lower. So I guess one, two, three to explore. Sorry, we have to disrupt the world again. This is going to be a little more complicated. Maybe too. you'll make it better. Yeah, probably. Oh god. Yeah, because I have to go down, and this is already at the border. Okay, we still on here we go. Here? Uh, not really. No, but, we'll, uh, we'll make it work. We'll, we'll, we'll figure, we'll figure, figure it out. We'll figure out the map yeah, and we'll figure out what the cards yeah. are. Yeah. You know, in the meantime, can I see the objective cards up close? Totally. Yeah. So. Memorize them. <laughs> Ooh, careful. Ooh. Yeah. That's All right. Great. I think yeah. we need to go well, a little higher. Don't worry about the cards. Worry about the yeah. map. Well, yeah, yeah. Well, we can put the cards here or something, too. We have a little more, a little more. There we go. All okay. right. And so now let's see what I'm going to do with this guy. Now I'm the wonder reader. <laughs> so 
lot of water. <laughs> I like having barbarians near me. They're a good source of trade. Yeah, Herb I mean, like especially for your faction. Yeah. I'm gonna so take a picture of these. Go for it. They're on the other side. Um, of the board. We need, Honestly, um, we could put them here. Can we I... need a space, a new space. Oh no, that wouldn't be. It wouldn't be legal to get the barbarian closer <laughs> to me, would it? Be. Right. Because I did one. Well, until two, Josh builds three. Up. So I only have one more. Mm -hmm. Um. Can you get us a city-state? It is yeah. the star defensive star icon. That is obviously a cod. Mm -hmm. And what they and do... Their diplomacy card says, Your armies can move through rival control tokens. Cute. Seems pretty that good. seems pretty good. They're all pretty good. That's a um, secret. So I think I'm just going to withdraw him with my last movement. Okay, Brandon. Um... Hmm. <clears throat> I am going to, while you were doing all that, I should have been looking at my districts. What districts do I want to create if I want to create one? Let's see. Um, oh. Oh. God, the barbarian's about to move. Ugh. They move a lot. I hate them. <laughs> Probably. They're so, you know, barbarian-like mm -hmm. and chaotic. I think I... So, okay, so starting my turn, I will... Uh... That's funny. The barbarian has to go into an empty space, which means this one is, like, super penned in. I can't really send it towards Katie because I can't no. put it... I can't yeah, you can like only on push it closer yeah. to you. <laughs> so the barbarian will exist... Even if, let's say, this spot gets covered, we yes. just have it to does not destroy, destroy the barbarian. It, yeah. it then it, just can't respawn. It just stops the respawning. Right. Oh. right. Um, yeah. Okay, I am going to put my encampment up there, I think, because it's Where scary the over there. Oh, I see. Oh, yeah. Um, fine. I'll just put that, since, since irrigation is in my fourth slot, I might as well take advantage and put it in the desert. So uh, what that encampment does is... Uh, it can defeat a barbarian or rival army within two spaces of this district when the districts activate. And I, then I can reinforce one friendly control token within two spaces of it. Mm -hmm. So that seems... That seems good. Reasonable. Okay, uh, that's my move. God, it's all just down to how risky... Because barbarians destroy districts too, right? Uh, sure. Mm. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> Don't you sure. sure. It's <laughs> fucked up. Um, okay. I'm going to pop currency then, because I don't like that barbarian being right here. Um, so I'm going to go, this one's going to go one, two, it kills the barbarian, stops it its movement. It tase them. And it does not gain it anything. It non-violently And then I'm going to go the one, two, three, situation. explore. Give me an explore, mm. please. Okay. We've almost mapped out the whole world. Yeah, there's what, four tiles left? Four tiles okay. left. What's that? <clears throat> What I need to do is keep going south. I think that's up. Yeah, that's really gonna help us. Uh, You're creating help us the out biggest here. lake if you do that, though. Jeez, I'm fine with that. <laughs> yeah. Diamonds and. Is that coal? Hmm. What is this? What's what? Oh, oh, it's a wonder. natural wonder with yeah. diamond. I get, I get. Sorry. And then this one is a natural wonder with oil. I did not. I did not dry. think my. Um, Oh, oil would be good to have on the board. I did not think my upgrades through. Yeah. All right, we got. Some, we need some water. Okay. We got a lot of water. Five. <laughs> I made a little lake. <laughs> wow. Yeah. It's a big it. lake. Meanwhile, we need a. Whatever. Should be the last works. remaining natural wonder. Go boost on. Sure. Put it on, man. Yeah. And a diamond. Great. That's me. Ah. <sighs> because that was one, two, three, explore. Yep. Katie. Done. Then barbarians move. So I think I'm actually going to place a district and do it on the diamond. Ooh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, nice. Um, and that's my turn. Yeah. Easy. Tick tock, easy. barbarians move. I'm rolling. Okay. Thank five, God. I made the right choice. It would this have eaten way. My oh, they, district. Jesus this one Christ. tries to go in the water. It bounces off the map and ends up going here. Yep. Guarding that marble. Um, that one does the same thing. This one's going to move here. Oh, wait. Orange. Oh, yeah. yeah. Your, your army, army gets washed by a barbarian. <gasps> no. And this one is going to bounce off the edge of the map there and end up here. Yep. There we okay. go. 
Uh, that's that. Uh, Josh, you're up. Oh, jeez. Okay. Um, I'm going to build a district. I'm going to build my, uh, my campus right here. All right, that's me. Easy. Okay. I will... <clears throat> Uh, using the soul power, I'm actually going to move this barbarian back towards my encampment, to where when um, when those fire soon, I can just take it out. And then I think I just use mathematics here. Let me think this through. What's uh, tier three growth? Sanitation. Mm -hmm. oh, that's pretty cool. Uh, but tier three military is also pretty cool from what I remember. They can move through water. I can start getting aggressive. Okay, I am going to use mathematics <laughs> for two, three, four, five with these tokens. Mathematics also says um, place a trade token from the supply on one of your focus cards. I'm gonna go ahead and throw that on Hmm. Um, early Empire? Let's just start getting more control tokens faster, I think. Love it. And then my dial moves up 5, taking me to 13. I am going to upgrade my military card. So I have um, mass production now. Beautiful. That's it. I'm going to do Early Empire. So at 5, so I can put on any territory or any terrain. Two control tokens, but I'm going to put two more out because of my trade goods, so four control tokens. So I am going to mature my capital wow. right off that bat. That's me. Katie, you're up. All right. So <coughs> I am going to place one trade token from the supply onto one of my focus cards. Which, uh, then, what action are you doing? Oh, the science. Mathematics? Yeah, or, mathematics. yes. Yeah. Um, and then, I'm going to figure that out later. But then I'm going to advance my tile and upgrade one mm. of my cards. Let me see. Three, four, five. Oh! So I actually oh. advanced two. Nice. <laughs> yeah. Love that. Yeah. Two yeah. and yeah. the three. A two and a three. Yep. So I need to make more decisions, but I won't hold everybody up doing that. That's fine because we're just um, gonna we're gonna yeah. hit the district tick. Yeah. Yep. So yeah. if you got a district, you get something. I do. Okay. Yep. Okay. I'm getting one onto industry. I am getting three more on mathematics, and my encampment is going to defeat this barbarian. So, nice. uh, and, and I had uh, built a city on its spawn point, so finally that scourge is over, uh, and it reinforces a nearby yeah. problem yeah. control token. Okay. Josh, you're up. All right. Um, and uh, I get a trade good for defeating a barbarian, so it's gonna go nice. on pottery. I really need to get World Wonders going. I'm using astrology with three trade tokens for eight, which gives me. A new level two and a new level three. Ooh. Um, I'll be improving my culture. Ooh, next round we get um, new and governments. I will yes. be improving my industry. Brandon, right, yes. you're up. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> I think. Hmm. Well, I was going to use Early Empire since it's my gov it has my Republic government on it before, before I switch, changes. but it doesn't quite get me to yeah. mountains and desert. I don't really care about deserts, so yeah, I just misplayed that government mm -hmm. pretty pretty badly. So let's not dwell on that then. Um, it seems like I probably just go for some mass production. Move each of your armies up to five spaces. They can move into spaces matching the slot's terrain or lower, as well as water. Mm -hmm. uh, my combat value equals this slot's number plus two. And I can move an attack with one of my armies that was defeated this turn a second time after returning oh, it to this card. That's cool. Yeah, so... <clears throat> uh, they will both have to start at my capital city. Yep. And then I think... 
So I basically have three attempts to just take that nearby fort. Yeah, which I think, <laughs> given the, the point value. Yeah. Uh, I think it's something I'm going to do that. I am going to move my first army into the fort. So my combat value is seven, and its combat value is six. Uh, yes. It wins ties, though, so yes. I need you to roll low for me, please. Okay. All right, here we go. I rolled a two, you four, a ten. failed. Failed. <laughs> okay, so that one... It returns from the tile on which it get, came. Uh, so it, it goes back here. It just bounces one space. Uh, the failed attacker does? Yeah. No, I thought you said they were defeated. Yeah. Uh, I, yeah, I, armies are defeated. No, no, only on defending do they get removed. When attacking, they bounce. They return to the but space they came the from. The text of this card certainly implies that it says that was defeated this turn a second time after returning it to this card. Oh. So I'm double checking. Let's double check it. Yeah, 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 I apologize. Uh, additional, or, oh, let's see, after an attack. If the defender wins, the attacking army is defeated. And oh, return to the, yeah. great. Okay, so, so it goes back to my capital, but can go again. So, yes, it do it again. Uh, we're going to say this is the same army trying again. Yes. <laughs> rather than the other army. Yes. It does not matter, but right. I feel like if at first you don't high, succeed. So yeah. Four uh, versus so three. That'll take it. Uh, nine. Right? Nine to my, I had seven plus four is 11. There you go. We did it. We've taken a fort. Put my city there, and, and I can mark for important. now the at first, least. The first point the first, on the board. Yes. Yes. And game ends as soon as anyone hits four, right? Like instantly? Uh, no, we play out the round so that Got we all get an equal number of turns. And your other army um, still gets to do something. Yeah, it does. It can still move five spaces. And it can Through go water? across water. So you so can I could go explore. That barbarian, too. Oh, that's interesting, too. That would kind of free up that area to expand into. Um, I find it interesting that your, your symbol is the asterisk. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Don't read into that. Um, I am going to. I'm going to explore this away. I think they're just going to go one and explore here. Ooh. Yeah. Spicy. Let's find something new to conquer. Uh, we've got a barbarian with some resources on both sides. Mm. I'm tired of Mercury. <laughs> Let's put it. Uh, you had a touch four. Yeah. How does this work? Okay, let's think about this for a second here. Uh, huh, this is an awkward spot, isn't it? Yes. Uh, um. Can... <laughs> how You're the one who did even that. Fit? It fits. It, like, over here. I mean, how do I even follow the... Yeah. Yeah. No, no. Uh, can, can this side of it even... Maybe yes, this side that's cannot. The side. Oh, wait. That's the side. Like, no, that's uh, only three. I'm moving three. Move it yeah, one towards Brandon. Here. That's, that's hey, there we did. We did it. All right. Oh, and then okay. we need another water space. Yep. We're Fill almost out of water space. Um, oh, no, this is Barbarian Sea spawns there. And then we have some oil and marble. Yep. <clears throat> um, Can barbarians, they can't enter water, right? They can't sail? They cannot. Oh, no, they do sail. Yes. They do so sail. this would hit my city. <laughs> yeah. Right. Uh, it can't destroy my capital sure. city, but it would like steal some trade goods, I think. I just, um, I'm not yeah. done here. That's oh, only great. two phases of movement. So I'm going to try to take them out with right. that army. Uh, so they have they a have plus mountains. five, yes. and I'm adding a plus seven. So here we go. Ooh, ten. Geez, I have to beat ten. Three, ten to ten. Ten, ten to ten. I lose that tie. I don't have a trade good I can spend. Army goes away. Brutal. Mm. All right. At the start of my turn, I've been forgetting to use soul. I can actually move the barbarian one. <laughs> so I'm doing um, I don't think you can. I don't think you can make that move because it can't sit in water, and oh. it, and you can't and you can't move it, it into it an awkward space. Water. Yeah. Okay. Okay. That's fine. Uh, I can move barbarian one. I, I can make. I may move a barbarian to an adjacent empty space. You could send this one at the green army. Yeah, but they want. Oh, I mean, I guess. The problem is he wants to fight them. <clears throat> Well, um, then at least moving them in the mountain makes them history plus history. one defense. Yes, so that's, that's a great call. History. And then I'm going to do... Uh, okay, so I'm going to do science at four. I'm going, <laughs> going to, to spend, do science. I'm going to do science. Plus two trade, plus one from my government. Hits me to wow. seven. Seven knocks me up to yeah. ten. Jeez. Which gets me two upgrades. That's pretty good. Oh, yep. i got to move my military card. So I'm going to take... Turn. I'm going to upgrade my um, industry to uh, animal husbandry. Uh, and I'm going to upgrade my... Oh, excuse me. No, I'm gonna upgrade my yeah industry to animal husbandry, and I'm gonna upgrade my uh, currency to uh, banking. I'm gonna use my my fancy my fancy Ottoman Empire mm. nonsense. Fancy. Um, I should also, I guess, 
I'll leave, I'll leave Ibrahim with you. I think that still makes sense. Okay. That is it for me. And this moves down to the bottom of the track. Katie, you're up. All right. I'm going to move my caravan to the city state. Ooh, nice. That is uh, Kabul. Yeah. I can't believe you beat me to getting getting that one. All right, who else took one? Because no, no, never mind. Sorry, both copies are here. I can still do it. Okay. Uh, when attacking a city or city state other than Kabul, increase your combat value by three. Ooh. That's pretty good. Thank you, thank you. All right, that's it. Tick tock. Oh yeah. That's you nice. also get um, two trade goods on your oh. military card because that's a military city. Yeah. Oh. Uh, from over there, either way. Uh, she needs two trade yeah. goods, and, and your caravan just returns to your, okay. to your card. Okay. Um, government change and wonder cycle. Oh, hell yeah. Uh, so government is going to be communism one, it goes on my for me. Trade. Yeah, communism's the only way to go. It's going to go on my foreign trade. Yeah, likewise. Well, I don't know. Where was oh, it? switch to This is from the city state. As well. What does it say? Oh, you're where to put the trade tokens, yeah, Katie? Yeah. Uh, because it's a military city, oh, yeah, it has to go on your military. Card. military. Yeah. Oh, and I, I'm oh, sorry, I should okay. I put a trade token oh. away when I move the card, but yeah, I have one trade token out. on industry. Nice. nice. Okay, Josh, you're up. Okay. <clears throat> um, I'm using... Oh, uh, and we have to rotate these wonders. Yeah. So oh shit, new wonders. Hanging gardens and great library are now discounted, but uh, the yellow stack we are now up to medieval wonders. Kilwa Kisiwani, when you move a caravan to a city-state, place one additional trade token from the supply on any of your focus cards. Mm, okay. And Petra rotates out for Alhambra. When attacking or defending, combat value plus two. That's a pretty good one. <coughs> What's the um, <coughs> cost of these? Uh, nine, and it likes diamonds and marbles on the Kilwa Kisiwani. Me too. And ten, and it's oil and marble okay. on Alhambra. And then for the discounted two? Uh, the Great Library is down to seven and takes um, uh, Mercury and Diamonds. Okay. That's the one that lets you uh, copy someone's tech when you uh, get a caravan to them. And Hanging Gardens is the one that lets you place a control token at the start of your turn adjacent to a friendly city. And that costs now seven and likes Marble and Diamonds. So yeah, I am um, executing foreign trade. I'm going to go one. I'm going to, for two, going to explore. Oh. All right. Um, uh, does this do anything for me? <laughs> it's not great. Uh, it uh, puts like it gives you like another private city state. Yeah, Jeez. yeah. Maybe that's. Well, I, I should at least look at the other side. <laughs> um, oh, this is a sciency city state. They were were they both? Sci should no, I, the other one's culture. Yeah. Um, so the star culture and the star science. What can we find out what those do? Ha, um, let's see. The star science is Palenque. Pal how are you that? Um, uh, their diplomacy card says that you can spend resource tokens as trade tokens Ooh, when resolving focus tokens cards. As trade tokens. <clears throat> and uh, the science, or sorry, the culture one, uh, Antana Narivo. Mm -hmm. uh, during your turn, it is treated as one of your cities and not a city state. Oh. Your armies cannot end their movement in its space, though. That's fun. So I guess during your turn, so you can put control tokens around it and stuff. That's yeah, odd. Ooh, that is odd. Yeah. What's going to be? Um, sure, why not? Okay, so that's two, and then so that's three is going to be over one. here. All right, and so I'm Tana Narevo. And a marble. Is there any way to get that adjacent to, to where I was? Probably not, but I don't think so. No, that would. Oh wait, work. yeah, yeah. yeah. There you go. Oh. Okay, perfect. So wow. yeah, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna. Jeez. Visit. Wait. Yeah, yeah. That's legal. That's yeah. perfect. All right. Wow. So. Okay. Take it. So during your turns, that is your city. And he gets two trade as well. And yeah. you get two trade tokens on your culture. Yeah. Oh man, my area is getting super crazy. <laughs> yeah. So do we want yeah, to put so the, these else's. over there again? Yeah. Let's move them back um, yeah. to Brandon. Yeah. Sure. That Good. Is. Yeah. Because I'll be the one putting my tokens on. Oh. Yes. Correct. Uh, um, so I get two tokens, and I can put that. Oh, they they have you to must go on culture. culture. That's it. Yeah. Where the hell is culture? Oh, hey, there we go. And it's Brandon's turn. All right, let's build a library. Um, I have pottery with communism, making it treated as the fifth slot. Build a world wonder. Your production equals the slot's number, so five. I don't think I even need to spend the trade good on it. I will spend mercury to go six seven, and that is the current cost of the great library. So, the Great Library should live in my capital, I guess. Uh, <laughs> it's pretty great. It Pottery is. for Communists is a good name. Mm. It should be a band. 
Pottery for Communists <laughs> is a good band name, yeah. <laughs> Uh, so when my caravan moves into another player's city, I may gain a focus card of the same type and tech level uh, as a card in that player's focus row. So I copy your technologies. Sure. Uh, okay, that was my pod reaction, and I'm done. And what do we get next? We get... Uh, oh, yeah. Potala Palace, a medieval Ooh. wonder. You can have four diplomacy cards from each other player. When you build this wonder, Ooh, you may right. take a total of three diplomacy yeah. cards of your choice from other players. Love it. Well, that's pretty that good. That is interesting. Yep. No. I'm going to pop Animal Husbandry. Communism moves it up to the fourth slot, which okay. lets me build on deserts. Uh, and mm. I may build within three spaces of a friendly space. So, one, two, three. The Desert yeah. City wow. has been built. Nice. Adjacent to a natural wonder and two other resources. Yes, sir. That's, that's going it's to be good. Yes, sir. It's going to do good work for you. Yep. That's, that's been the plan Josh, for a while. Can, can your it. army cross water yet? you got to blow, <laughs> blow them up. That's me. <laughs> Well, I'm actually not playing very fighty. No, well, nobody started okay. next to me, so it's kind of yeah. hard. I've been avoiding you. <laughs> yeah, you, you're kind of the isolationist there. You've basically had a fort between you and other people, and uh, then you're just going to, if you try to move your army through that, you'll just end up attacking it. Wait, how did this even happen? You got your army here? Did you, okay. you went around the fort? Uh, yeah. I, I oh, wow, well. okay. Yeah. <laughs> I, mean, I chased down that barbarian. Mm hmm. Mm. I think I'm going to fight the Barbarians. Yes. Whoa. Yeah. Whoa. So, because then I can actually place a control token on that side. So I'm going to move my army mm -hmm. up to three spaces and confront them there. Okay. Um, Josh, you want to roll for the Barbarians? Yeah, they, sure. they have a plus three because they're on forests. And so we... I'm in four and I do have two to my combat. Okay. Five to three. Ooh. So, so eight versus seven. The so, shift is so winner you, tie. Uh, she needs to win, so you would need to spend both trade tokens to win That's here. That's fine. Yeah, it's worth yeah, it. But it that is. works. And then you get a trade token back for defeating a barbarian. It could go on the same card or a different, or any card. I'm gonna put it on my... And we can knock that barbarian off the board. Alright, awesome. Well and done. I'll try to eradicate him next time. You grab that. Yeah, thank you. Okay. Uh, barbarians move now. Uh, are there barbarians on the board? Oh yeah, over yeah, here and okay. down here. Yeah, uh, let's roll a die. They move in the five direction yet again this way. So here, here, here. They're really sitting That's on it. some resources, mm -hmm. and you have moved into that space. Oh, yeah. uh, okay. Oh, don't forget to move your masonry card down, Katie. Oh, and yes, then Josh, sorry. it's your turn. Oops. Okay. Um. <laughs> I am going to execute nationalism as though it was in the fifth row mm -hmm. or column, which um, Ooh, gives it a production of seven. Um, and then I'm going to spend this for eight, as well as my mercury for ten towards that palace. Whoa. Oh, the mercury doesn't go there. Um, so if I could have that palace, please. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, sorry, what's it look like again? It's a blue. Uh, yes, it is blue. Um, it's like it's, a reddish uh, thing with walls. This is this is the the least elegant little part of this is. game is like finding Absolutely. which wonder token. Oh, but it's here. Here it is. All right. Um, and then this will go here. And now each of you will give me defensive pack, joint war, and embassy. Sorry, I think it's three total from among your opponents, not three from each. Oh, from other. Pl okay, you're right. I think you're right. That would be insane. Um, then I'll just take joint war from each of you. <laughs> wow. Okay. Oh, so. Wow. Okay. So you have Checks out. plus six when attacking neutral targets and yes. plus four when attacking any of us. Yes. Correct. That seems That's pretty good. real good. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> what do you got? Uh, nothing that good. <laughs> um, I, my campus is about to happen again. Well, mm. Okay, so districts are about to happen again. So I could go two directions with this. I could use... My science card because it's about to get even more tokens, or I could place a new district that would then uh, fire. I place one control token. So the theater square places a control token on a space within two spaces of this district. Pretty cool. Um, wow, I'm real torn. Uh, irrigation, it can go on forests. Hmm. Um, no, I think I want tech. I'm going to stay focused. 
<laughs> I because I want to level up my economy card yep. to to my signature uh, signature move. Yeah, yeah, civilization one. So three trade goods plus it was in slot two, so I'm getting gonna get five, which puts me just shy of a level four. But uh, the level three yep. econ was what I wanted. That's my cartography. It moves each of my caravans up to six spaces. They can move into that train or lower as well as water. Um, when they reach rival cities that are eight or more spaces from my capital, I can build a city in illegal spaces in two spaces of that Ooh, city. That's juicy. So I can pop up. You're a colonizer. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm, just, I'm a cartographer. <laughs> no, you're a colonizer. Uh, I'm going to pop banking. So uh, I'm going to move both my caravans <laughs> up to six spaces and they can sail. Uh, so this one's going to go to uh, Mohenodaro. So I get back. two trade goods onto my culture. Uh, mm -hmm. Do you more. already have their? Yeah, you already have their their yeah, diplomacy card. Okay, I'm just I'm just farming culture. Yep. But here's the fun one: is one, two, three, four, five, six. Brandon, I sent one to you. Whoa! Uh, so I get two trade goods for that, mm -hmm. and because you have my Ibrahim card, I gain mm -hmm. one more. Re or excuse me, I gain a resource of my choice from the supply. Wow! Uh, um. And these trade goods can go anywhere because it was to a. Yeah, to a capital, so I can put them wherever I want. You get a resource of your choice. What's your yeah. What's your choice? I don't fucking know. <laughs> um, I'm gonna send. Do I get anything from no? Being it's, on it's this end you, of the exchange, it's, it's when you when send I do it to it. me. Oh. So you should do that. Come I'm working me. on it. Um, man, so I'm gonna put one onto industry, and I'm gonna put one onto God. I guess I'll put God. one of the culture because that's super useful for me. Uh, and then I'm going to get one resource of my choice, um, which I'm going to take a... Oh, by the way, I forgot really quick to move Barbarian and start my turn. Do you mind? No. Oh. I am going to... My, my plan... It's the kind of thing I wouldn't say out loud if we were not on camera, but... So get this barbarian over here, crossing over by my <laughs> camera where my camera can take it out. That's, that's beautiful. It's the long game, but um, it's going to happen. I get, oh man, I get one resource from the supply. I guess I will take a Mercury because I'm never going to get it otherwise. <laughs> Here you I'm go. never going to get that. Um, and then that's me. That's easy. That's it. Katie. That's the whole thing. Okay, so I'm going to place a district. Place this guy. I got to use banking. That was Can fun. Yeah. That was, a a free bank. resource off the map is actually kind of crazy. Pretty good. Yeah. All right. And then I'm reinforcing the number. I have this, um, the the skip from the monarchy. So mm -hmm. I'm gonna do Ooh. five. I'm gonna do one, two, three, four to give me a mature city, and five. Okay. Okay. Uh, okay. Advance. So districts proc. Okay. So I'm gonna get another three uh, trade goods on science Jeez, from my capital. Need not really. Yeah, I'm basically one science uh, usage from. Yeah, I mean you're, you're gonna max it out. Sadly, yeah. that's not one of the game objectives no, this time. But it's fun. <laughs> Josh, you're up. Yes. Um, oh, I did get trade tokens from my district as well. I've got to remind myself what the tier because doesn't the tier four science kind of add another reason to keep using it? it? Does, yes. Okay. Um, I, I think I'm gonna. <laughs> Run uh, my score oh. Earth policy. Yeah, nuclear power. Yeah, it just lets you nuke someone. Yeah. <laughs> my, okay, yeah. <laughs> seems seems all right. Seems decent. <clears throat> oh, there's a lot of barbarians about this. Katie, did you here. do your economy one? That's a trade token for each mature city. Right? Oh yeah, and I did. Which you do have all mature city. Have yeah. One, yeah. So you get trade one token. trade token on any. Yeah. Oh no, on your. Uh, wait, Ooh. sorry. Oh, it does both thing. One trade token per mature city on any focus card. Oh, oh, or okay. one per uh, one on economy per friendly deserts. Which I feel like hmm. <clears throat> Excuse me. Loaded up on pottery. Per friendly yeah, desert. Okay. That feels right. Okay. Actually, I'm gonna run. Oh no. From on poetry. Um, oh, I just hmm. Hmm. I just realized I've been doing something kind of wrong. I don't think it actually throws off any of my thresholds, but I think I can fix it. Um, the districts only look at friendly spaces, which this one is not. Oh. I had kind of missed it that it had to be friendly mountains. Too. The water is considered friendly yeah. with my power. Oh, so yeah. basically so I'm gonna lose too. one now and drop I back met, my dial I did too. that yeah. incorrectly as well. Yep. All right, delete your YouTube comment. 
Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, I'm running uh, drama and poetry from the five slots, so I'm putting out some control tokens. It's going to be <coughs> wow. The world. Oh go my god! Here for some diamond. Here for natural wonder. Um, wow. Here, since this counts as one of my cities, and here. Wow. Um, and then I can move. That's very good. Um, I can move a token after doing that, which I will do. I will move this here. So the next time. Oh no! It, next time it'll already proc. So mine can't miss this then. Mine can't reinforces the token, so I'll just do that. Oh. Brandon, is hmm? Gobastan a plain, a hill, or a mountain? <laughs> uh, all natural wonders are mountains, oh, I believe, as far as like sense, the, the, their terrain difficulty. Yes. yes. Mm. Okay. Yeah, and just to confirm, oh yeah, you placed lots of stuff in mountains, so that must have been in your fifth slot, right? Yes, it was. As you did that? Okay. Um, let me... I think, oh man, I wish, oh wait, no, I have it, yes! Okay, that's right. I had a plan. Time to do the plan. Uh, early Empire is in the four slot. I'm about to mature my fort. <laughs> I'm going to spend the trade token. So I'm going to put three control tokens around cities. I'll grab that Mercury, and this fort is now a mature city for me. Meaning my caravans can leave from there. Everything that's is fun. coming up, Brandon. Okay. okay. Um, man. Yes. This is wacky. So I can spend resources. Yeah, okay. I'm going to do masonry to attack. I'm going to move my army into this fort. Ooh, um, going for the I, fort. I may use... Um, well, I don't know. God, it's at five, and the fort is at six. Math is not great. <laughs> uh, sorry, I'm trying to decide if that's actually the right decision. Maybe I won't do that. Maybe I'm, maybe I'm lying. Um... What's the blue wonder that's up right now? That's the porcelain tower. When you build this wonder, replace up to two cards in your focus row with cards of the next highest type. It costs nine, and it likes mercury and diamonds. I see. <laughs> <laughs> you sound interested. I am. I'm intrigued. Yeah, that's pretty good. It is, yeah, it is pretty the, good. The science wonders are generally my favorite to build. I love finding fancy ways to... Get all yeah, my my science upgraded. wonder doesn't really do anything about that. It's the one that I got. The... You, it was just one that just upgraded three of the time you obtained. No, that's the pyramids. No, no, no. What did yours do? The the science upgrade I got was the one that got me the diplomacy. Oh upgrade, yeah, which is a oh, weird so thing for a little... science yeah. wonder to do. Um, I'm gonna pop my level four growth to get <clears throat> a district. I'm mm. gonna put out my theater district um, because it was in four. I can go into a desert, so it's going here. I've got my my desert. It's Red Rocks. It's the Red Rocks Theater. Um, <laughs> that's it for me. My theater district. You're up. What's up, Katie? I think I missed because I had oh. just placed the district. Yeah, what's but the... my army's on it. What's the theater district doing? It was place one control token Ooh, yeah. within, within two, two spaces okay, yeah. of the district. So I'm just Go going to very quickly retcon it and just put him here. Um, for my turn. Wow, that actually... Ruined me. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Well done. Interesting. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> um, I'm going to use my five slot uh, industry with my three extra um, production points as well as diamond. So that's five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten to build the tower. Here you go. Enjoy. Thank you. I'll take uh, those uh, resources. Yeah. Yeah. Well done. Yeah. All right, so I will look to replace here. Okay. Once I can figure this. If we tick up, barbarians reappear. H is back. K is back. Wait, no, K's still out. D is back. Any other uncovered right. barbarians? I don't think so. Oh wait, F is back. No, F is still out. Right, because Brandon keeps fucking chasing them away. <laughs> That's it. Uh, and also, uh, Hanging Gardens is gone. Goodbye, Hanging Gardens. Where have we been putting the... Perfect. 
you, that's Nailed. that's where I've been putting it. Uh, wow, so we're gonna discount these, including, did we even look at the Amundsen-Scott research station that just came up? It's our first modern wonder, because we've oh. all been buying the science ones. When you build this wonder, build a city on any legal space on the edge of the map and place this wonder into that city. Then place up to two control tokens in spaces Ooh. adjacent to that city. So That's when you fun. build this, you just get a city somewhere with this wonder and two control tokens. Mm. Uh, the new uh, culture wonder is the Taj Mahal. When you resolve a focus card, resolve it as though it were one slot further to the right for each world wonder you control matching that card's type. That's fun. Okay. Joshua. Uh, so I'm going to run my military. Uh-oh. And it is coming from slot 5. Um, I can move up to 4 spaces. Mm-hmm. Hmm. hmm. Okay, so I'm gonna go one, two, three, four, and attack this fort. Wow, uh, with a base strength of oh, eleven. <laughs> um, okay, I will roll for the fort. It has uh, six defense plus three, nine. I think you did it. Uh, yep. yep. Sixteen. Congrats. Um, okay. Place a city there and your uh, token on the one fort objective. Love uh, it. Yes, uh, token on an objective. Um, and then the other, I will go one, two, three, four, and attack your control token. Whoa. So I only get plus four because you don't joint war against yourself. Correct. Um, so I'm at a base of nine Jeez. against your fort, which is, what did we say it was? No, you're not against my fort. You're against my control token, you said. Oh, yeah, yeah. sorry. So it's, 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 it's got, got one. one. Yeah. Okay. Uh, six. Four. <laughs> Um, so, uh, wow! Yeah. Um, and then, Dick move. Um, oh, after I win a combat as the attacker, place a trade token on. Oh, but it can't carry one. Plus one additional trade token if you attack a rival city or city state, um, which I, that hasn't happened. Wow! Yet. Um, but then, um, once per turn, after I win an attack against a control token, I may discard it instead of replacing it to move. <laughs> um, so I will discard that, and then. Uh, uh, the attacking arm, then I can to move and uh, and attack with the attacking army a second time. So then I will be attacking the fort. Oh so, my God. Does the fact that my army's there do anything? I, do you know? Do, like, are you recall. actually attacking my army yeah. on this one or anything I, like that? I think that I think I that your have army to, uh, add, like yeah. adds one to the defense <clears throat> value. <clears throat> Let's see. Initiating attacks. If an army is attacking a space with multiple pieces, the player controlling the attacking army chooses which piece to be the attack. Oh, well, obviously um, the city. Barbarian yes. must be the target. Yes. Okay, so... There you go. Uh, does that army add, like, help me at all? I guess not. How does that make really? sense? I would think that it would add one to the... Yeah, they're on the hills. I'm, I'm they're double outside. checking. They're, they're doing um, training. They're running they're sleeping yeah. in the barracks. Yeah. 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 <laughs> oh, no. I'm sure you, you two will tell us how we did it wrong. Yeah. <laughs> This ruins everything. I love it. Go for it. Yeah. All right. Um, That's what you get for stacking up units. <laughs> let's see. How does your army all the way over there? I mean, I was yeah. hanging out here, right? And then I got one, two, three, Travel four, and then my bonus raft. move. <laughs> yeah, sure. Boats. <laughs> oh, if there's at least one army friendly to the defender, uh, the defender adds two to its combat value. Two. Okay. Two. Yeah. So you've got, what's at the base of a fort then? Six. So you've got so, six, seven, eight. Nine. Or just, just or uh, seven, six, seven, eight, eight, eight nine. nine. So it's yeah. actually nine against nine for the base. Ooh, so it's yeah, coming so down just to a roll. roll. But you have three trade tokens you on your military? Tokens. Oh, God. All right. So I got to roll like a six. You have to roll a one. Uh, I rolled a one, though. Okay. And I... Uh, uh, maybe just re-roll that. You yeah. rolled it into a tray of tokens. Five. Five. That seems like right. that'll do it. Yeah, I don't even need the tokens. Ouch. All right. Wow. So you lose the... Here's your army. Uh, thanks. <laughs> and, uh, and then this guy comes back to the card, right? Yes. Uh, um, no, I think it remains no, no, there. Right yeah. remains oh, there. so do they both remain there? Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. And you get the two fort. Yeah, throw out another. I do. That's so true. you're a two. Oh. Spicy, spicy. Oh, no. That's what Zulu's for. Brandon, oh, kick his ass. Go fight him. No. <laughs> <laughs> get nukes. <laughs> I do need nukes. You're right. That is, that is something I can probably accomplish here. Um... 
Let me read the, okay. I'm gonna take half a second here to read the nuke card. I'll read it aloud so we all remember what nukes do. It's fucked up. Nukes if, you, if you resolve this card in the fifth slot, so I would need to up, to like use yeah, yeah. use my science card, upgrade it, and then yeah, go to the top. Um, although I could take a science, I could take democracy as good yes. at nukes, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> um, that, that checks out. If you resolve this card in the fifth slot, choose one space. In that space and all adjacent spaces, destroy all unreinforced control tokens and flip all reinforced control tokens to their unreinforced side and advance your tech. Oh, it doesn't destroy cities. Oh, it's not it's actually. It's actually not it would super just relevant. Destroy all my control tokens that are around Don't that do court. That. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you can nuke your own. Okay. <laughs> that kind of makes sense. So you're building up bunkers or whatever. Yeah. This is super mean. Attack him with just a regular army. I think, I actually seem to recall that the level 3 upgrade for military is better for this sort of situation. I have level 3 military. What's, My combat value that? equals the slot's number plus 2. Yeah. So it would be 5. I just wish I had some trade tokens on it, because Josh does. Hmm. Well, or you can just start reinforcing like crazy for the plan to attack next turn. Right? I can reinforced. I can at least at the start of my turn move a barbarian to an empty space. Let's send barbarians yeah. towards Josh. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> and I was planning on just trading. I was going to send caravans out. You can still do that. You can trade with me now. I was no, too far away. Trade before. with me. <laughs> like I needed to get, I needed to get over there so That's I could trade. With you. Uh, that was a mature city for me. I was gonna depart my caravans from there. It was gonna be so good. <laughs> well, it's gone. Man, you on back to back turns, you two have completely <laughs> fucked over <laughs> my, my plans. No, everyone but you. <laughs> I'm doing great. Well, um, we're friends. Get, get with the surprisingly, program, when Katie put this control token here, because I was gonna send send a caravan over here, and with my cartography, then I can place a city within two, and I was gonna put it here. Mm. But this space, I don't think it's still ne it's next to the natural wonder, which is why I like that one. But that's not within two. I don't think you can count through the Probably empty not. space. Yeah, and so, <clears throat> and also don't think I can just drop it on the fort. <laughs> Sadly, <sighs> man, that was pretty fucked up of you, Josh. <laughs> I still probably should just use cartography because it's in my top slot and I can copy technologies still. Um, let me get a good look at your technologies. My culture is still early empire, so like your drama and poetry looks like an upgrade. Anyone have level three culture? I do. Oh, you have civil service. Yeah. Can I, I can't get to you though anymore because Josh took my new mature city. <sighs> I can get to Christian, right? This is, this is where they have to go to. Trade, One, two, yes. three, four, five, six. Yes, yeah, so I can trade Do with that. you. It would not let, a bonus it would not let me deploy a city. There. It would not let me deploy a city, but it would let me copy... Your texts suck. I'm sorry, man. I'm doing my best. <laughs> I don't want any of that shit. I mean, I guess animal husbandry is an upgrade for me. Um, so if, if this die roll goes against me, do I just lose my capital city? Uh, no, if, can't get if a barbarian okay. hits your capital city, you have to discard trade goods or something. We can yeah, double check. Oh, okay. um, it's, it's not so it's bad. You can never lose bad. your capital city. Yes. I'm actually more hoping to help it get to your Same. fort here, which yes. that that it would just That's outright right. destroy. I, well, yeah. so I have soul too, so I'm going to move that towards his fort. Oh, I love that. We can team up with our soul yeah, diplomacy. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. Trade with me. We're on the same team. Come on. All right. I mean, the fort's easy enough to take back, so I don't Here's, think it's Okay, okay. Here. Here's what I do. I will trade with you. I'll do cartography. Okay. I move each of my caravans up to six spaces, and they can go through, uh, well, because it's in the slot five, any terrain or water. Uh, so they both lean from here. I will trade with Christian, I guess. One, two, three, four, five, six. So because... To get my... I just flipped this, right? This was yeah, not reinforced? None of them were reinforced. Uh, because... That's not eight away from my capital city. I don't get to spawn a city with cartography. But you get, uh, when you trade with the Ottoman player, place one of your trade tokens from the supply on one of your focus cards. So you get... A, so I get a total of three. three. Right? Two, for, and two normal plus this. And well. you get a trade token. Yeah, so there's yours. I get three. I think that they are just all going on my military card. It seems yeah. reasonable to me. Uh, okay, that one comes home. This caravan is going to go to Kabul mm -hmm. and get their diploma. Oh, wait, wait, wait. So let me not put, because I'm going to get two on, mass, yes. on uh, military from there. So I'll throw these on. Well, leave those uh, on military because you're getting them. <laughs> like, oh, that's true. Yeah, because yeah, now I'm going to get two on mass production. Yep. 
and I get Kabul's Diplomacy card, which gives me plus three when attacking any city or city-state other than Kabul. So, Love it. So, I'm set up for retaliation, but that's my turn. Great. Oh, and I'm sorry, I get to uh, copy your animal husbandry. It looks like the only one that's an upgrade yes. for me, so... I'm going to pop go. masonry. I'm going to attack the barbarians. Uh, so their defense is plus one. <laughs> and I'm at five. Roll it. Oh. Five. Uh, so, wow, that's a tie. So they <laughs> would win unless I spend this resource. Right? Okay, yeah. Which I'm going to do. Yeah. Seems so worth it. I kill it, and then I get that trade good back immediately, right? Yep. Yep. So Congrats. I actually, that's actually kind of nice because I can move it. So I'm going to move it on the side. Yeah, freeze it up. Yeah. Uh, slide everything around. <coughs> I'm done. All right. Katie. I am moving none of my cards and using my one slot animal husbandry to just build the city right there. Yeah. Oh, well, yeah. That's pretty good. Yeah. Okay. All right. Tick tock. Right. Barbarians move. Two. Which direction is two? Two is uh, this way. Yep. Mm, oh, so I'm sorry. This. Oh my god. I, well, I didn't say it, so it doesn't matter. It's oh yeah, late. if you had moved it here, it yeah, would have gone into his capital at least. Say it. I'm sorry. Damn. <laughs> rules. Okay, Josh. I would let you write kind of if we hadn't already rolled it down. No, no, it's, but... yeah, it's fine. <laughs> it's, not um, here. it's still like threatening you. That's fine. It is. And I mentioned that I would make this a two-part video if it seemed like it was going long enough. It so is. it is. So let's make it. We'll make this the last round before we'll take a break. I love it. Yeah. Oh, good. Um, so, I think for my part, what I'm going to do is build a district. I think it's about time I get the encampment out. Um, and it seems like... Seems like this would be a good space for the encampment. Um, you know what? Let's do it here. Um, alright. So that's... Mm -hmm. That's it. Brandon, you need to... <sighs> yeah, this, this is probably the best spot. Okay. I can do a district also. Or... Mmm. Mmm. My campus is going to give me another two trade... All right. You know what? I'm just doing it. I'm not going to sit here and think about whether this yes. is correct. I am going to use mathematics to get two plus two science. So four science. Taking me from uh, 16 to 20... Getting me a tier four, and that tier four is going to be... Nukes? Nukes. Yeah! Where is it? Here we Flavor. go. Nuclear power. Okay. I'm this is just it's defensive. It's a deterrent. Yeah, yeah. It's exactly, it's exactly. Right. I don't plan to fire I'm, these I'm nukes. popping oh, early empire with all three trade goods to let me get five control tokens out at, uh, at any location. So one. Wow. Two. Three. Four. That's real good. Five. Got a lot of resources now, baby. Okay, Katie, you're up. All right. I'm going to use my civil service and place Let's two see. control tokens, which I'm going to put them here and here to grab this baby. Um, and then place one more control token. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Finally getting some resources. <laughs> All right, that is that must be nice for you. That's the end of the round. So we're going to take wow. a break. Yes, we are. Okay. So um, thank you for watching part two. We'll be up on the channel. If you're watching this like the day it went up, um, in the next few days. I don't know when this is going up. So I, I do. But I'm oh. not telling anyone. <laughs> That's a test. <laughs> my information. Yeah. So subscribe to the channel and YouTube will let you know when that comes up. Or uh, if you're watching this any other time than when it was posted, you can probably just uh, let this like autoplay into it. It's um, a beautiful attitude. We'll be back soon for my yeah. sweet, I'm sweet revenge. Out, I'm getting really stressed <laughs> out. Yeah, it really, it, it, just in the last 10 minutes, it I'm like, went from I'm like, like, oh, this is pretty casual. Everyone's yeah. doing pretty good. To, like, oh, like, oh my oh, fucking shit. God. No, Josh, okay. it's, it's all you. It's, yeah, you're it's you're the one. One person attacked one thing, and you guys are acting like yeah. it. Yes. yes. <laughs> That's kind of how <laughs> war right. works. Yeah. Okay, yeah. <laughs> it does, it does tend to, uh, you know, escalate. One Archduke. <laughs> all right, well, thank you all for the game so far. Thank you for watching till the part two. Be optimal. It's beautiful. Did I say uh, optimal? I don't think I enunciated that very well. I think you're fine. You know, that's fine. Yeah, we're, we're, fine. fine. We're, we're using it. <laughs>